located in the white town of Pondicherry, Aurobindo Ashram has been named after its creator, Sri Aurobindo Ghosh. The foundation of this ashram was laid on 24th November in the year 1926 when he was surrounded by his disciples all over after he retired from politics and settled in Pondicherry. This ashram was set up with the aim of helping people attain moksha and inner peace. Thousands of tourists from all over the country visit the ashram to experience and achieve spiritual knowledge. The ashram is by far one of the wealthiest ashrams in the world. Also, the ashram does not have any branches and solely exists in Pondicherry. The day this ashram was set up is known as the founding day of the ashram which has been described by Sri Aurobindo in his writings as less being created than grown around me as its center. Mira Alfasa who was one of Aurobindo's followers played a vital role in the establishment of the ashram. Soon after Sri Aurobindo Ghosh's death in 1950, she took care of the Aurobindo ashram and was known as the mother of the ashram. At present, the ashram has over 500 devotees, 500 students involved in the Democratic Progress School and 1300 patients. All these people live in the ashram's main building which comprises of a block of houses which are connected with each other. These houses are located nearby the ashram at walking distance. Some of the facilities offered by the ashram including the library and the main building can be accessed only after receiving a gate pass from the bureau central or guest houses of the ashram. In addition to this, the ashram also has a spiritual center which consists of four houses which were inhabited by the mother and Sri Aurobindo for different intervals of time. There exists a samadhi as well in the courtyard under the Frangipani tree where the bodies of mother and Sri Aurobindo were buried. People come to pay their respect every day by laying flowers on it. The best time to visit the Aurobindo Ashram is during the winter months when the climate is pleasant and not sticky. The time between November and March is the most favorable. In addition to this, 15th August which is the birthday of Sri Aurobindo is another very busy time of the year for visiting the ashram. Cameras cannot be carried inside and the bags should be kept outside only. Children below 3 years are not allowed inside the Sri Aurobindo Ashram. The Aurobindo Ashram is situated next to the Bay of Bengal in the eastern Pondicherry. It lies at a distance of 160 km in southern Madras. One can easily hire a cab or take a local transport which moves to and fro at short intervals and reach the ashram.